loves, welcome back to my channel. So for those of you who don't know me, my name is Katya. And for those of you who do, welcome back. I hope you guys are having an amazing week. So for today's video, I thought I would do a DIY and a try on haul for you. I'm gonna start off with the try on haul first, like I always do, and then move my way into the DIY part. So if you're interested only in the DIY, I will put a time lapse down below so you don't have to watch the whole try on haul. But if you're interested, then the try on haul will start right now. I recently got more clothing from Salty Crush. You already know I love this company. I cannot get enough of their clothing, so I had to order more. Like, I don't have enough clothes, right? I know some of you are probably gonna be like, girl, you got enough clothes. It's enough, but I get rid of some and I get more. So I'm gonna start off with the first piece, and it is this one that I'm wearing right now. It is super comfy. If you're looking for a comfy dress, this is it. I mean, you are floating in it. I just loved the print. The print has this sort of tiger on it. I think it's a tiger. No, I think it's a lion. <laughs> lion or tiger, I'm not sure, but there's sort of like a jungle feel to this pattern and I just love it. I think the color is beautiful. You guys know I love my good balloon sleeve and I just think it's so cute. It goes all the way down to the floor. Well, I'm 5'4", so maybe if you're taller, then it'll probably reach you either your ankle. But as for me, it is just a perfect maxi dress. I got an extra small and it's made pretty loose. So just a little heads up, I just wanna let you know that it seems to be made a little bit bigger. So if you can downsize a size, uh, if you're normally, I don't know, a small, medium, or large, I would say just go a size smaller. But aside that, it is just beautiful and I am so happy about this. For my second piece, it is this beautiful dress, like sort of like a tunic. It has these gorgeous pom-pom detailings at the, I guess it's sort of midway and then at the end of the dress and also on the top here. I just think it adds some really cute like dimension and texture to the dress. The print's beautiful and just the color, I just love it. And of course it has a balloon sleeve. Um, so anyway, what's not to love about this dress? Whether you wanna dress it up, dress it down. I actually wore this dress to go get my wood at the hardware store, which you're probably gonna see. And it is super comfy, another comfy dress. If you're going for, you know, those days where you just don't want something stuck on your body, this is the perfect option. Actually, these two are the perfect options. For my next piece, I got this beautiful dress. I fell in love with the pattern. I think it has this whole hippie vibe because of the sleeves, it's like a bell sleeve. It also ties all the way at the bottom. So you have option to either close it all the way, open it a little bit just to let your leg peek through, or even completely wear it as a kimono, which is great. And then it ties at the back as well. So it's just a perfect hippie boho dress. I actually paired it with the next piece that I'm gonna share with you. Um, I know we're still in summer, but I'm thinking ahead. In the summertime, there are like right now in Montreal, there's pretty cool days. Well, there was hot days and recently this week, I find that there's been a lot of chilly days. I love to wear my knits even in the summertime over my dresses, even over some jean shorts, just to feel warm and cozy even in the summertime. So the next piece I got was this knit and I got it in a cream color. I think it fits beautiful. I cannot wait to wear it also in the fall, in the winter. I love the sleeve detailing and the length is just perfect. It has pockets. We love a good pocket. If you're looking for the perfect knit, this is it. It doesn't get better than this. I paired it with the previous dress and I think it looks perfect together. The color combination, I think it still stays a little bit in the summertime, but it's moving towards fallish as well. For those chilly days, you don't want to be wearing like super bright, colorful colors on a cold day. So I think this is the perfect combo. I could not be happier. This is actually a very heavy knit. The quality is beautiful. It has slits on the side here, which is great. What's just not to love about this knit? I just love it. <laughs> Moving on to my next piece, I think that this dress is so unique and so fun. First of all, I just love the print of it. It's the same print as this one, but in a different color. I'm obsessed with the ruffle detailing at the bottom. I think it is perfect. It's a very girly dress. It also ties at the back, which is great. I love a good dress that ties at the back, just so it can cinch in your waist and give you more of that hourglass look without it being too stuck on you, you know? You can adjust it and make it looser or tighter. It has the balloon sleeves. It also has a detailing at the uh, neckline here, which is so pretty. 
Moving on to my last piece, it is this amazing, I've already worn it, I got it and the same day I wore it. It is super comfy again, it is this cute romper, it's the same print as the hippie, I say hippie dress, I'm gonna write down the name for you, but it is the same pattern. It has my balloon sleeves, you know the tight and loose balloon sleeve, and look how cute this is. Right where the leg is, it sort of does like this little balloon, you have an option to tie it, and it sort of does a little balloon at the bottom of the romper. Super cute, these two little ties. It fits perfect. It's sort of a mix of comfiness meets girly, mixed boho, all of the good mixes together. And that's why I love Salty Crush so much. I will leave all their information down below. They are super sweet and are offering you a discount code. So if you're interested, everything's down below. Happy shopping. So that's pretty much it for the haul part. Now we're gonna move on to the DIY. I end up doing a wall hanging. The reason there's only one DIY is because this actually took me quite a long time. I always end up doing this to myself. I'm like, oh my gosh, I could totally do this. It's gonna be easy. I start doing it and it takes forever. So this one actually took two days, but I'm just warning you, it might take between two to three days to finish this one, just because you have to let everything dry and then set everything in place. So it was a pretty long DIY, I'm not gonna lie. I'm honest about that. Without further ado, we're gonna jump right into this DIY part. Enjoy.
hope you enjoyed this video. Comment down below. Let me know which dress or outfit was your favorite. Or if you did enjoy this DIY, please give it a thumbs up. It means the world to me. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all your beautiful messages and comments. I am really so grateful that you take the time to write to me. So anyway, have an amazing day. Love you always. Mwah. Bye.